all right people I have not recorded in a long time I had I'm, I apologize I had a calculus 3 test this Friday and I had a mass and energy balances test today so you know I had to get my own my little study thing you know had to go balls to the wall on the studying so that means no games you know but anyway let's get into the deck that I'm gonna be using for this uh, survivor mode I'm using a deck that I just created I'm gonna put the link to this deck in the description or whatever I just created this deck. I'm basically the reasoning for this deck is I'm going to win the battle. That's that's basically the uh, the reasoning for it. And I have uh, three damage reducers in the Grek, Duan, and Manevra. Manevra being more of an offensive def defender, if that makes any sense. And so you see, R plus Ombre equals basically a free eight damage on the opponent. And for my damage reducers, I have a uh, a Logan so I'm pretty sure I can get some damage in and then I have uh, so I have three primary or well, four primary um attackers in the Celia CR Logan Michael and Thomas and then I have three defensive cards in Duan Minerva and Greg Smack so let's uh let's just see how we're gonna do in this battle so let's go on head over here and change the game mode real quick let's see what we can do all right so I'm gonna go ahead over to survivor extended and I'm gonna click play and let's just see how we do. All right, I'm going against a Mr. Freaky. <laughs> Straight up. Straight up. This dude's name is Mr. Freaky. I don't even understand. But <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know. I, I, I just don't even know right now. But anyway, um, the reason I like using schedule a lot is because uh, an SOA clan like this does absolutely nothing to my hand. And I have uh, Minerva here to attack. I'm pretty sure I might start this game off with a Logan, and if he uh, plans on putting that uh, Panda Grand out there, I can pull out a Grack to scare him. So, all in all, this looks like a pretty okay. So I might just have to go for the 2 HKO here. So what's that? Five. So if they go six pills, that's going to be uh, basically 30. So let's just go 40, and then see if I can get the easy KO with. Let's see what let's see what he wants to do. All right. So that means I got an easy win off this one. But never going all the way. Pa -da -da -da. That's why I said it's a it's a, a offense it's a defender. However, you can ha it has a very good offensive capability because it's uh both minus power and damage. So let's just go ahead and get this win and head on to our next battle after this. This was a real really short uh 2 HKO by the crazy gorilla so um I'm feeling pretty good today, you know. I just got my car fixed. That set me back about $300. Uh, I was going to spend that on Grand Theft Auto 5, but hey. It's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood, you know. You know, I'm African American, so I was probably going to just buy a pair of Jordans regardless with that money. So, <laughs> uh, No racism, though. Anyway, he goes out with the pentagram as I expected. So I got the easy win. I didn't even feel like counting pills. So let's just go into the next battle. All right. Also, um, I'm about to start leaning toward. I might instead of having Greg, I might put in a a Nista Rock. Now, before you get crazy, there, there's an explanation for it. And however, I don't feel like discussing it at the moment. Um, I'm about to go in here, Logan, really deep. And I can use Minerva for Celia CR, so I'm just gonna go out here, Logan, pretty deep. 64, yeah, 64 looks good. Um, the reasoning I might have a Nistarok instead of a Grack is because I'm using Ombre, and Ombre is a courage-based card. So, with a uh, Grack in there, you have the uh, you have the off chance of getting a four-star and going, to, and you want to have courage as much as possible on the first round. So if you had a five star car instead of a four star car, you you would win the star battle in order to go first because they base upon they base the first uh, player to move based upon the amount of stars he has in his hand on a round. So okay, so that was a good good attack by Logan. So I pretty much got this game in the bag. Um, anyway, so I might put in a either a Nistarok or another type card. I'm not entirely sure yet though. 
I might put in Lady. But Grack is just so solid of a card with a minimum of one five damage. It's just, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> Shaggy has left the battle, you know. Like a ghost had come out to haunt him or something, you know. Shaggy Scooby-Doo. Oh, you'll get it later. You're probably too young to know about it. So I'm going through these matches in rapid succession at the moment. Um, I see absolutely nothing this guy can do. So I'm about to go out here with uh, a Michael. One, two, uh, six pills. That's 60. So that should be an easy win. And then I can just go out there with Celia CR and get that win relatively easy. Um, <sighs> I'm a little tired. You know, I've been studying really hard for a week straight. So my, my body is basically broken down right now. So I can't quite put in the, the, the enthusiasm that <laughs> a video like this would need because I just got drained I was getting my car fixed from like 9 this morning till 12:45, so that was a very long period of time of me sitting there my phone ran out of battery so I was just sitting there with the sad puppy dog face crying basically okay see what he was trying to do with Flint but uh, you're one pill too short there nil eight are you <laughs> I'm just playing. I don't know how to pronounce that. N E L eight R U. Okay, whatever. So th this game is a wash for this young fellow, cause seven times five, which is the highest he. Well, ooh, wow, my math is off. Seven times three is twenty one, which is the highest he can reach. So that's basically a wash for this young fellow. All right, so that's uh, three times seven. As I said, that was twenty one. So let's just go ahead and put twenty four and go on to our next battle. Uh-huh, uh-huh, pills, yeah, cheap. That was a cheap move. Is it sheep or cheap? I don't know if the CH <laughs> is pronounced like an S. I don't know. I don't know. So let's get on to this next battle. I am flying through these battles. It's only been seven minutes, and I'm already on my fourth battle. I am straight up flying. So I got the ombre in the hand. I see he got the huracan. So I'm going to have to, oh, Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. There's no reason sell you shouldn't come out. So I'm coming out there. One, two. That's five pills. Five times uh, seven is thirty-five. Uh, let's one more pill, and um, we're just gonna throw out Minerva next turn. If yeah, oh wow, he might just throw out El Grasco, which would be an excellent move. However, I uh, I don't know if that would be that good of a move, honestly. But uh, Michael's coming out next round. I'm expecting the El Grasco. That would be uh, Garscaro. Excuse me, El Gascaro. Sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry. But that would be the best move. I would do that, and then I would have El Divino coming out there with three pills. Oh, he decided to take me head on. Uh, that was a horrible move on his part. The amount of pills that he would have needed to overcome what I just did would have been. He would have had to waste two more pills, so actually three more pills because then he would have just have matched me. So that was a quick and easy match right there. There's absolutely nothing this young fella can do. Uh, death metal, <laughs> death metal 17. So you're yeah, the 17th death metal. You're not even original, bro. You have no originality, bro. So anyway, I don't feel like doing pill counting right now. I'm just trying to go through these as fast as possible. So now I'm on Survivor 4. Or was this Survivor 4? I should be on Survivor 5. Yeah. Anyway, get that really quick win with Minerva. So I'm flying through these battles as you can see. This is amazing. I don't think I've ever gone this fast before. So I'm already on Survivor 5 in 9 minutes. It is crazy. Why do they keep giving me these uh, low level opponents? must be a new day Kirk 531 okay oh yes that's what I'm talking about Zernado so I really oh yeah there's absolutely nothing he could do against this pain that I'm about to inflict for the nourishment of his body so I need this win very badly because then I could I have two damage reducers so I'm about to go in there as deep as possible and go ahead and take off this eight damage really quick and really clean and then I always have a Dwan that I can use I might just go out there with Ombre, Max Pill. You never know. That, yeah, that might be the best option <laughs> to go out there with Ombre, Max Pill. It all depends on how he wants to play the game. Uh, you can.